Hello, I'm Chris. For those of you who haven't watched this before, I do a personal vlog every month and uh, it's basically a monthly update on how my attempts to live a bit healthier are going. So I'm trying to figure out a way so I don't have glare on my glasses, but I think we're just going to have to muddle through. Okay, so this is the update for July 2020. Uh, I'm going to just hit the major points and I'm going to try and keep this one really brief. So the major points are going to be uh, weight loss, exercise, uh, mental health and just what's going on with me in general so four options so we'll start off with number one weight loss um weight loss uh i lost a bit of weight at the start of the month uh i then gained a bit of it back i think i've come out at the end of july slightly down where i started from but it's not something i've been stressing about it's not something that's really i'm that bothered about i kind of knew it wasn't going to be a great month um i still want to kind of get fitter um, there's some stuff I want to try and do in 2021 that requires my fitness level to be a bit better than it is now. Um, and I'm going to try, so I'm going to keep working on that, which brings me to number two, exercise. Uh, so I'm still not running. It's been too hot. Uh, work hasn't been helping the hours I've been doing, but I have been trying to walk as much as I can. And I've got a fair, a fair distance in that. And, um... Yeah, not as many lo big long walks, but I've been trying to get shorter walks in where I can. So I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, so third, mental health. The walking's helped with that. Um, I've kind of been a mixed bag. Work has still been stressing me out. I think it's kind of time for me to kind of think about maybe making a change with work, uh, looking what else is out there, because I'm just finding that it's quite draining on me at the moment. So that's that's meant. Uh, the the one thing that's really helped with mental health is we've had an easing in lockdown. Uh, I've got to see some some of my family. Uh, I've got to hang out with them, catch up. That's done me the world of good, and um, I'm kind of trying to practice better self care. Some days I'm doing all right with that. Some days I'm not. So like I said, it's not every day I'm feeling great or every day I'm feeling bad. It's just kind of I have peaks and troughs. Uh, so one thing I'm going to try and do to kind of improve my mental health and to make me feel more productive is I'm going to try and get back with uh, into my writing. Uh, I started a project earlier this year. It was going really well, but then I kind of realised I hadn't planned ahead and I've kind of written myself into a corner. So I'm restarting that. Um, luckily, I've got like a better idea and I've got some of the stuff already in place, but it's just restarting is always quite hard. So that's my next thing. Um... Uh, I've also been feeling kind of good because I've started making more TikToks. I've had some likes for my stuff over there, and I know it. I know it seems meaningless, but you know it does give you that little serotonin. Is it so serotonin? I don't think it is. Uh, that's the only brain chemical I know because I'm dumb, and that's why I'm not a qualified nurse, folks. Um, so yeah, I'm. Uh, that's made me feel good, um, and I just feel. In some areas, I'm quite positive where I am. I'm feeling better about myself. I don't feel as negative about certain stuff. Certain other stuff, I'm still kind of seeing room for improvement. So what's going on with me in August? Uh, not much. We're still kind of half on lockdown. So I'm still going to try and keep active. I'm going to still try and walk as much as I can. And I'm going to try and work on some of my bucket list items. Anyway, that's the July update. Uh, kept this one pretty short. I'm pretty ha ha proud of that. I'll be back in a month. I'll probably drop in another video of something else before then, if I can think of something to do. All right, be excellent to each other. Bye-bye.